it must have missed by only centimetres. So the first score of the first qualifying final is to the West Coast Eagles, a behind kick by Mitchell White. Peter Matera off the ground, that breeze is really blowing here. And again, it'll be a, a boundary throw in about 35 metres from goal. Mick Moldhouse. It certainly doesn't look like being a high scoring game, Wes. Not a happy little chappy, is he, Michael Malthouse, as a result of that goal being kicked by Stephen Collinew. And Peter Matera has forced a boundary throw in just outside 50 metres, but we're down to one and a half minutes left in the game, and it would be a travesty of justice now if the Bulldogs could pinch this game because the Eagles have controlled it since early in the second term. Have a look at Mickey Malthouse, he's on the edge of his seat. Williams has just delivered an absolute up and under, it's gone nowhere. Ellis couldn't take the mark. And a boundary throw in has been forced by Mitchell White. Just forward of centre wing. And Look at Mickey! It's his <laughs> last. Well, it's not going to be his last game, but he's still pretty involved. He wants to win this game for the West Coast Eagles. Darcy in front. Line for a mark, or alternatively, running out of the centre square and kicking a goal on the run as Garlic did earlier. All they have to do is lock the ball up. And a lot's going to depend on the bounce from the umpire. Few going back into the back line. 